Hi there, my friend, Chad Reyes, excited to be with you again. And today we're gonna to be talking about burning your bridges. Think of that, burn your bridges. You need to burn your bridges. Whew, that's a powerful one. Because if you think about it, if you don't burn your bridges, then you'll retreat back and you won't move forward in your vision. Many years ago, I heard this story of a general who would go to war and he would bring his boat to war and he would have all of his men on there and then he would light the boat on fire and say, now we gotta win the war because there's no way to go back. We either win or we die. And my friend, today I'm asking you to burn your bridges. So many people, you may be one of them, have visions for what they want. I want to build this business. I want to launch this company. I want to move here. I want to move there. You see, options are great. Only when you burn your bridges first. See, if your option is retreat back to the known, retreat back to what's comfortable, then you've given yourself the ability to go back to what's comfortable rather, to, rather than moving forward in your purpose, in your calling. See, burning your bridges is not ruining relationships. Burning your bridges is not allowing yourself to retreat back. So case in point in 2020, when the pandemic happened, my wife and I and my partner John, we made a decision. I want to give you a real example. We made a decision at that very moment, around March 20th, that we were not going to retreat back into fear. We burned that bridge right then and there and we said, that's not an option. Not an option, we can't go back. We burned that bridge and we just proceed forward. You see, behind me is a wall. I'm going to give you a case in point and an example. The wall that's behind me, I can't go back. So I only have the option to move forward. And in our lives, we choose the wall. We choose if the wall's here, we choose if the wall's back 100 feet, if the wall's forward 100 feet. We put the walls in our life. And I want you to burn your bridges. Don't allow yourself to go back to what's comfortable when you have so much potential, so much opportunity in front of you. You see, fear wants us to retreat, but love wants to walk in our fulfilling and our calling. My friend, don't allow the burning, don't allow the, the boats to be there as an option to retreat. Burn the bridge. Burn the ability to go back to comfortable and only walk forward in what you were called to do, what God put in your heart. Because I just know this. I know that you can never, ever accomplish what you want to accomplish in your lifetime if you consistently allow yourself to have the option to go back. The option to go back will eventually make its way in and you will eventually retreat. Burn that bridge, choose to move forward. You know, my father was a Marine. And as I'm sharing this, I'm thinking through the story in my head. My father was a Marine. And one of the things that a Marine does is a Marine continues to move forward disciplined. And when one of their men die, they know that they care about that man tremendously. But they know that they have a responsibility to protect those that are alive. And keep moving forward. Burn your bridges. Burn your bridges. And become who you were designed to be. I believe in you. I value you. God bless you.